Hello, Sunny Bonani, beautiful people. So I came across this story. Dubai has introduced vending machines for free bread, free bread to its citizens. Mahala free. You just go to the vending machine. You type the type of bread that you want. They even have different types of breads. Like you can choose brown bread, rye bread. Chapati bread, like like you choose. There are choices. It's free. It's vending machines. Some are in the supermarkets. Some are just in different random places around Dubai for people who cannot afford bread, so that they can still be able to eat. They don't have to go and queue up in a soup kitchen. They just go there, do 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 in a machine, and they get the bread. And it got me thinking. Hmm, Dubai, the Dubai that's making money from us as Africans. Do you know who is buying that bread for the citizens of Dubai? It is the African politicians and the African tenderpreneurs and entrepreneurs who are spending loads of their money going to holiday in Dubai. Congratulations to Dubai. And when it comes to us as a continent, there is still a lot we need to change. Because, yo, it is so sad when you see that some countries really care for their citizens. Some countries really do take action. Whereas with us, it's always vote and promises. Vote and promises. When money comes, are they spending it here? No, they're not spending it here. So... Do you think your country, especially if you are African, for us who are African, do you think your country will ever come up with such ideas? Do you think the people who are the leaders in your country could ever come up with such a thing? And if they did, do you think it could actually end up happening or the money will just disappear and we will never even see the lights of those vending machines let me know let me know down below let's have a healthy conversation let me know what you think and don't forget to subscribe and like the video